Thanks to modern technology and engineering innovations, trains now run at amazing speeds. It wasn't until 1964, when the first high-speed network started in Japan called the Shinkansen, and today the latest train models even exceed the speed of 600 km per hour. In this video, we present the 10 fastest railway systems in the world, which are not only famous for their impressive speed, but also the basis of future transport. Number 10. Italy High-Speed Network Italy's high-speed rail network, Alta Velocita, is one of the most advanced systems in Europe, connecting the country's most important cities. The first section, the Direttissima between Rome and Florence, opened in 1977, setting the stage for the future of Italian high-speed railways. The current network includes the Frecchia Rossa, Frecchia Argento and Frecchia Bianca lines, with top speeds of up to 300 km per hour. For the most part, a wide selection of ETR trains operate on the network, in eight versions, all manufactured by the Italian subsidiaries of Alstom or Hitachi. The AV network plays an important role not only domestically, but also in international connections, so the Italian railway is one of the drivers of sustainable transport in Europe. And it was here that its first privately owned railway network, operated by Italo, opened for the first time, with Italo average 575 trains, among the fastest in the world. Number 9. Intercity Express. Germany's high-speed rail network, also known as Intercity Express, is a 2008-kilometer-long rail network that provides fast passenger transport between the largest German cities such as Frankfurt, Munich, Dortmund, and Berlin. In 1991, the first line connecting the German city of Hamburg with the already mentioned Frankfurt was handed over, and since then the network has been better developed, creating one of the most high-quality and famous networks in the world. On the high-speed tracks that cross the country, the maximum permitted speed is 300 km per hour, as in Italy, but trains rarely reach this speed. Almost all trains were manufactured by the German Siemens, the most famous type being the Siemens Valero, eight versions of which are operated by Deutsche Bahn. The network also extends to other neighboring countries and in the future trains will even be able to go to London. Number 8. United Kingdom's High-Speed Network the United Kingdom is significant in terms of railway history, given that the world's first railway line ran here, and today their network looks much more modern. The current high-speed network means the modified lines on the London-Paris section of the Channel Tunnel, also known as High Speed 1. However, in the future, within the framework of a multi-billion dollar project, they would like to expand the network, which was named High Speed 2, which will connect London and the city of Birmingham for the first time with a length of 225 km by 2030 the development of which began in 2019. The maximum permitted speed on the current network is 300 km per hour, and British Rail operates trains manufactured by Alstom and Hitachi. Number 7. AV Network The high-speed network connecting the cities of Seville, Cordoba and Madrid was opened in 1992, and since then it has become the second longest network in the world with 3,973 km. The network is operated by RINF which operates the AF trains. These trains can reach a speed of up to 310 km per hour, and the Spanish Talgo and the already mentioned Siemens Valero trains operate in different versions. The special feature of the Spanish network is that the lines use the European standard gauge, so they play an important role not only domestically, but also on international routes. AF trains are renowned for their punctuality, comfort and environmentally friendly operation, which contributes to Spain's sustainable transport strategy. Number 6. Alborac Alborac is a modern high-speed rail network in Morocco that began operations in 2018. It is the first high-speed railway in North Africa and runs between the cities of Casablanca and Tangier at speeds of up to 320 km per hour. The line is operated by Morocco's National Railway Company, ONCF, and cuts the travel time between Tangier and Casablanca by more than half, to around 2 hours. The railway technology is based on the French TGV technology, but we will talk about these trains and the fractional network later. The purpose of the Alborac project is to modernize transportation, connect the northern and economically important regions of the country, and promote sustainable development in Morocco. Number 5. KTX The Korea Train Express, also known as KTX, is a high-speed rail network in South Korea operated by Korea. It began operating in 2004, and the network consists of 12 main lines, including the country's largest cities such as Seoul and Busan. There are four main train types operating on a high-speed network, 
the first being the KTX-1, based on the French TGV technology and manufactured by Alstom. Another main train type is the KTX Sanjin, which was also manufactured by Hyundai Rotem based on the French model. In January 2021, the third train type, the KTX EM, was introduced, which was also manufactured by Hyundai and has a much lower performance than the previous models. In some cases, the trains can reach a speed of 305 km per hour, creating one of the fastest and most developed networks in Asia. Number 4. TGV France's high-speed rail network, which was built at the same time as Japan's Shinkansen, and whose first section was delivered in 1981, now covers the whole of France. 120 million people use it every year, the network is 2,800 km long. Trains manufactured by the French Alstom operate on the network in six types. TGV trains usually travel on the lines at a speed of 300 km per hour, but their maximum speed can be up to 320 km per hour making it the fastest high-speed network in Europe. Although this is the maximum speed allowed on the lines, in 2007 a modified POS-type TGV train was able to reach an absolute speed of 574.8 km per hour. In doing so, it became the world's fastest conventional train on wheels and created a stack that only magnetic trains could beat. Number 3. Shinkansen. It was the first in the history of high-speed trains and is still one of the fastest networks. The Japanese Shinkansen also known as the bullet train, consists of five main lines, of which the 1964 Takedo Shinkansen was the very first. It is 2,388 kilometers long and 25 types of trains run on it, almost all of them made by Japanese manufacturers such as Hitachi, and other high-speed networks in the world are also based on this technology. The speed of each line depends on the maximum speed allowed on the given line and the maximum speed of the trains running on the given line. The fastest is the Nozomi line, where the operating speed is 300 km per hour, but the maximum speed of the fastest Shinkansen train reaches 320 km per hour. Number 2. Indonesia's High Speed Network It was handed over in October 2023 and is based on Chinese railway technology with Chinese investment. The 142-kilometer-long railway consists of three stations and stretches between the capital Jakarta and Bandung, and they want to expand it further towards the eastern part of the country in the future. Chinese Fuxinghao CR400 off trains operate on the line, which is the current fastest wheeled traditional train model in the world. The Indonesian railway network was originally designed for a speed of 420 km per hour, but currently the maximum permitted speed of trains is 350 km per hour, while the record speed reaches 385 km per hour. Number 1. China's High Speed Rail Network China currently has the longest and most developed railway network in the world, which is 46,000 km long. The trains are mostly built with technology stolen from the West. The fastest ones include the aforementioned CRH 400 off and BF, as well as the Hexi Hao CRH 380A, B, C, D. The fastest allowed speed is 350 km per hour, similar to Indonesia. The reason for this absolute first place, however, is to be found in Shanghai. The world's fastest operating magnetic railway, which is also referred to as the Shanghai Maglev, operates there between the city center and the airport. Its maximum speed is 431 km per hour, which means that you can reach the city center in 8 minutes. A similar train is planned to be built between Shanghai and Beijing, but this will only be realized in the future. These were the fastest trains in the world. Write in the comments which one you would most like to travel on, and if you want to see similar content in the future, be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching, see you in the next time.